This video is on how to break the bead on a tire, specifically on an aluminum rim. The wheels and tires that I'm working on are 25 years old. The tires are dry rotted. They will not be recycled. Thus, I'm just trying to get the tire off the rim. Now granted, I could take the wheels and tires to a local uh, tire store and have them remove them, but I wanted to attempt this on my own and then see what this was like. Uh, this is my way or my approach. I've seen many videos where do-it-yourselfers have removed tires from steel wheels and in many cases they're going to discard the wheel or they're not concerned with the condition of the wheel. If it gets marred up, scraped up, scratched, dinged, dented, whatever. But in this case I'm going to resell or sell these wheels and I don't want to get, I don't want them damaged. Uh, I have seen the bumper jack approach. I've also seen the floor jack uh, with the tension strap approach those are all good ways to do this but I just wanted to try something a little different uh, what I've done here I've used if you have or if you've done any suspension work you likely have a spring compressor and that's what we're looking at here so what I've done is to drill a hole in the sidewall of the tire on both sides and I've uh, I've run this through the tire on both sides and that allows for um, for these to come together so it's pretty straightforward and then i hit this with uh, an impact wrench as the camera should show the bead is clearly broken the bead is definitely broken on this side i cut this hole in the side just really so i could see and the camera's not going to show it but just to see where i was in terms of the bead coming off uh, on the inside here is a quick view using two spring compressors Clearly, the bead has been broken on both sides. Uh, I'm good to go here other than I need to cut the tire, or at least cut the bead, and then uh, pull the tire off the rim. And this one will be done. This was very quick and easy, I should say. Again, drill holes on both sides of the tire, put the uh, spring compressor through, and then you're good to go. It's, uh, it's really quick. I hope this is helpful.